Hi there, I'm going to show you some paintings, some of mine, some of other master painters, that demonstrate the characteristics of expressive paint. Check this out. On the left is a painting that Georgia O'Keeffe did when she was in art school. This is definitely realism, which is what she was taught. On the right are, is one of her later paintings, which is painted expressively. Any subject matter can be painted expressively. It's more about the approach rather than the subject matter. With expressive painting, nature can be your subject matter, but it is painted in an abstracted fashion rather than realistically. Expressive painting means that you can take an intuitive approach to color and shape, any color and any shape that you like. Another characteristic of expressive painting that is frequently seen is the use of pattern and a decorative approach. As you saw in the Matisse video, he loved pattern and included a lot of pattern and flat design in his work. He also celebrated the use of color. Okay, to sum it up, the key ideas of expressive painting are that it's not bound by reality, you're free to paint subjectively and with a personal approach, use a flat perspective, abstracted elements with active brush strokes, use of symbols, an intuitive approach, and an emphasis on aesthetic beauty. So there you have it. You've been set free to paint in the style that you want to paint in by those trailblazers like Matisse, who were called wild beasts by the critics. We can now paint in the manner that we prefer to paint in. So let's go for it.